and select new game. Starts. Good morning, Manticore Research Group in association with us. Welcome to Get out of bed. Just a second, guys. All right. So, as I stated, this is kind of one of the games that I had been most looking forward to out of all the games that Atherin had brought to my attention. For those of you who have been following me throughout the... <clears throat> month of Spooktober. Uh, I made a deal with the community and with Atherin last um, Spooktober that I would play whatever games Atherin brings up. He has to pick my games and I would play them. And this is one that he he brought to my attention. So uh, a little bit of a different. Uh, A little bit of a different type of game than what I've been playing before. This is, uh, we're out in outer space <clears throat> on a base somewhere out in the cosmos. The only thing I know about it after watching the trailer is that something goes wrong on this base. So it's spooky. In space. So, let's kickstart this off. <clears throat> all of my gear. Is there a light that I can switch on somewhere? Anything I can interact with? Nope. Nope. Just gotta go to the door. Open the door. Here we go. Out we go. Oh. What the? Hello? Anyone there? <clears throat> so apparently, the game has already gone wrong. What the hell happened here? That's blood. That is fantastic. <clears throat> Hello, Master Choice. Hello, Vlad. Welcome to Moons of Madness. <laughs> anyway. So, as I was stating before, this is probably pick up flashlight. Okay, let's find the flashlight first. <clears throat> Hello, Larkspur. Hi, babe. Oh, that's the flashlight. Okay, looks more like a camera than anything else. Whoa. Oh. Oh, what the? What is that? Gosh. What is... It's gross. That looks like stuff from Stranger Things. Like the Upside Down. Ah. Let's go. What's in this spooky little... Oh, that's outside. All right. <coughs> Needs disinfectant. <clears throat> This hall looks a little bit more safe. I'm gonna go down this hall. Oh, I can't. Hmm. Let's turn off the light. I can't, I can't. So that's crouch. Why can't I run? I wanna run. I wanna be free. Oh, 
coffee stains? Ah, what <clears throat> is going on here? I kind of don't want to. Oh. Okay. <laughs> Whoa! What is that? All right, this game is just like automatically. There's no hey, a, a brief temporary glimpse of what things used to be. No, let's just throw you right into the madness. Uh, obviously, hitting X on this does not work. Pushing. I know. Look at the ground. It's on the other side of there. Well, nothing. I can't get through there, so we got to go this way. Anything I can pick up? No. Hmm. Whoa. This place is free K. Oh, tools. Ha ha! <clears throat> I get a crowbar. Add to inventory. What else is down there? Just a crowbar? Fine. I, you know, I would love to have a flamethrower right now. In all of my games, I have not gotten to fight back whatever I'm- ah, ah, ah. I have not gotten to fight back whatever I'm- I'm against whatever I, is in the game. So, I'd love the opportunity to be fit. oh. Oh, that's fantastic. It's just completely dark down here. Yeah. Troitz has gotten to fight back in at least one of his games. I have gotten to fight back in zero. So far this Spooktober, I have been led through a haunted house of horrors in horror adventure. I was led through the madhouse in, uh, what was it? Uh, Outlast? I was chased by a janitor with a bat in, uh, what is it? White Day, a labyrinth called School. Right open, there's gonna be something on the other side of this door, I feel. I don't think I wanted to open this door. Sounds like there's something in here. How is my volume, by the way? I'm thinking my my is a little a little too loud, so I'm gonna adjust that just a little bit. There, that should be a little bit better. Let me know if I'm still a little too loud. All right, let's get on with this. Come, blow out the candle. Uh, I'd rather not. I, I like my candle. Can I have a bag, please? Oh, there's those circles again. Okay, some workout equipment. Uh, how about I be with you after I finish my morning workout? I just woke up. I'd like to, you know, bench press some things. Uh, I guess not. Vlad, if you could somehow super hack a flamethrower into this game, that would be fantastic. I need you to work on that, please. <gasps> oh, what the fudge! Oh my god. What was that? <laughs> oh, rise and shine, folks. Is everybody okay? <clears throat> I almost spilled my coffee. Almost. I'm not. Uh, I'll, I'll have to check the readings, but that may have been our biggest quake yet. Rude awakening. Standard sure. procedure. Okay, New so heart. that was just you know a dream. What to do. If there's any critical damage oh, to the base, let me know. Yeah, 
Okay, uh, no problem. Dr. Van Buren, you <laughs> will true. assist me at the landing site for the Cyrano. Declan, okay. you're on comms. Find any so. system issues, relay them to Shane. Aye, aye. That was... Captain. Switch to a private frequency, Declan. No chatter on open channels. Over and out. That was just a dream. Private Luke. channel time. Hmm. So, I got some space rock. Read. Dear Dad. Oh. Boring. Alright. Since this is my last stream of Spooktober, I am going to go ahead and uh, throw down as much as now, I can. Now, where did I put that ID card? Did you awaken to another nightmare, though? Probably. Yeah. And what better way to start the day than assessing possible life-threatening damage from minor seismic activity? Hmm. Beautiful. <laughs> That's what I've been told. So I am Shane Newhart. Engineering. Ah, apparently I have a son. Good luck out there, sport. Dad. Wait. Or maybe that's from his dad. Oh, I oh five oh nine. This. I need my ID card. What? I... Whoa. Hmm, door's locked. <clears throat> Probably triggered by the quake. I'll have to unlock it at my terminal. Of course. Got my ID card. Head to inventory. Okay. Drawers! I think it was O five O five O nine. Sweet. All personnel. Please be aware of the new security update that's taking place tomorrow. You might be stuck in your room for a while. Write down the code somewhere so you'll remember it. <clears throat> Unlock door. Okay. Confirming my ID bypassed security for my room. Doors unlocked now. Okay. Sweet. Now I can leave. Yeah, adjust the camera a little bit, I think. Right about there. Pull it over. Yeah, that's good. Okay. Danger. He we come. Yes, he come. He come now. Well, the rest of the team's out dusting morning the landing routine. pad, and Dr. Bokolva's apparently it's me this way to my room morning routine. Duties. So, I guess that means you have the base all to yourself. And where are you? Once more, I venture into the great unknown. On duty at the satellite dish. What the hell? I'm currently communicating, hey, which is what's up with the lights? Uh, yeah, getting some odd spikes in power as the batteries kick in. Hey, you, you just hang tight while I do your job for you, okay? No, have a coffee. No, really. Take take a load off. Okay. I will have a coffee. There's a light. A light. Do your dishes. <laughs> well, what should I eat today? Oh. That's bacon? Uh... Can you check your bio gauge and see if your daily objectives have been updated? Copy that. Oh, space food. Crap. What's up? I, uh, I seem to have misplaced my bio gauge. Josie saw it in the lab on her way out. Told me to tell you. Better get it before you do anything else. Speaking of which, that should do it. I fixed the lounge door to the lab. <clears throat> okay. I'm gonna go down this way. That's why he sounds... That's why he sounds... Sounded like. Oh, 
Okay. Huh. Okay. Serious question time. When you get Earthside, are you going to ask Manticore for a raise? Hey, you don't want to talk? That's cool. That's cool. I'll just be here. Not talking. Not talking. Now I can run. Go through that door. This takes me back. So weird. There's a room. There was a stuck door in the dream I had. That's not important. It's, it's just weird. Uh, you're forgetting the last three times something malfunctioned in this over-engineered campsite. that bio cage. Good. I think there's a reset button somewhere. Just my luck. I need to find something that can fit in there. Declan, I found the bio gauge, but it won't turn on. I need to reset it. Find something small and thin. A pen should work. You're telling me your finger couldn't fit on that little bitty button? <clears throat> there. Got it working. Great. Sweet. You should be able to reboot the security system now. Just scan the servers with the bio gauge. Missing something? Small tech? I was thinking the same thing. It's the ability to run again. Yeah, I think so. Yeah, let's hope not. I want to be able to run because that lady was creepy. Let's go upstairs. Apparently this place circles all the way around. A bush. Boom! 
quake probably knocked the panels out of alignment. This has been an ongoing issue. I'll have to adjust the solar panels manually. Eh. I don't want to read anything tonight. Ladies and gentlemen, I do apologize. Something has come up. I need to make a very quick phone call, but I will be back in about five minutes. I am so sorry. Not do this unless it was an emergency. Boo! Okay, I'm back. All right. Let's keep going. So... Oh. So apparently I need to restart something or other. Oh, I have a feeling I'm going to have to be back here later. This is going to be terrifying if the lights go out. <clears throat> Went the wrong way. Let's go this way.
Okay, that's the greenhouse. Okay, so it said open up. Well, continue. It said open up your journal. Objectives. Go to the solar panel array. That's nice. I wish there was like a radar that could, you know, kind of at least give me a general direction. I'm feeling this is a big circle. Yep. <clears throat> sudden sucked out into space. Glad I looked around, because I would have gone out there with 20% air. Let's replace that and see if I can't... Oh, I must already have a suit on. Because you can't interact with those. Okay. Alright, 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 alright. Let's see, my air is at 100%. Oh boy, heading outside. <clears throat> Exterior atmosphere opens it all. <clears throat> Please tell me I can jump. No, I can't jump. Oh, but I do get to drive something. That's sweet. Oh, but you couldn't pressurize this thing so I can take off my air? <clears throat> Declan, I am buckled in and headed to the solar panel array. Well, now you've got nothing to do but listen to me. Just when my migraine was starting to clear up. I'm actually glad to have the Sierra landing today. Some fresh faces, and supplies, and distractions. Everyone's so on edge lately. I don't know, maybe I'm just imagining it. These dreams are starting to get to me. Yeah, you're not the only one having strange dreams there, Ace. You too? Oh yeah. I mean, put yourself in my shoes. You log out after your shift, eat some rehydrated meatloaf, and bump down for the night. But the second you fall asleep, it feels like you're back at your desk and you hear the static again. Calibrate, more static, calibrate, then something sounds different, it's a pattern, you start decoding it, it's gibberish, but the static keeps talking. It wants you to hear the symbols. Now that I 
traffic cop in their scribble notes around me. Feels like I have to slip. All right, I showed you mine. Now lay it on me. Dreams, nightmares, fantasies, your deepest, darkest fears. Let's hear it. Sorry, I just pulled up to the office. I'll have to get back to you on all that. Eh, suit yourself. The anticipation is killing me. So, just so you know, I didn't drive that at all. It was all automated, and that was unfortunate. Oh, what's in here? Nothing. <clears throat> My oxygen levels are already full. Okay. That is not working. Someone must have borrowed a power cell. Declan, I'm heading up to the perilous rocky pathway. The power cell for the elevator is missing. Have fun. Oh, hey, just got an update from Commander Wilcox. Landing site preparations are underway. Also, she told me to clean up my shit at the comms tower. <laughs> She didn't want to scare off the new recruits. I like Josie. Maybe, who knows? Synchronized. I'll have to connect with my bio gauge to rotate them. If I'm quick, there may still be enough hours of daylight to recharge the overnight batteries. I need to get them to optimal. Is taking power cells from my solar array. Declan, who was out here last? Mm, probably Lucas on some errand for Volkova. Ah, they're always up to something weird. Creeps me out. I have never met a normal botanist. Probably want to head back and get some air. Ah, I can wait. Convenient. There's air right there. <clears throat> so I bet I've got to go down in there, get a power cell, then come back. Kind of glad to get out of the base, walk around. Yeah, it's nice to step outside, breathe in that non-existent Martian air. Well, there's that, but I can move out here. I don't 
trying to spread my wings a bit. Like a beautiful dead Martian swan. Like a dead Martian eagle, thank you. That was dumb. Indoor atmosphere. Got it. Oops. Huh? Who's that? What the? What? Don't know. Thought I saw someone. And thus, it begins Let's in just the get waking this done. hours. That's locked. Why is this locked? Why are the lights off? After 133 souls, primary mission is finally a success. I located a possible water ice deposit 36.8 kilometers east of here. Kirano crew will be notified as soon as they are within range. Investigations are underway. I have a feeling they found more than they bargained for. Power cell containment unit. This unit converts. Yeah, where is it? Boo! Got it. Yes, I'm trying I'm trying to restore the power, but unfortunately I I need a power cell which Can I climb? No. I wonder how far out I can just wander.
I know, I'm looking, I'm trying to get past it. <clears throat> There's a power cell. Okay, let's take this into the base behind me. It's almost like you gotta restore all these power cells everywhere you go. Lucky I brought along a power cell. Sweet. Well, looks like I have to use the computer to unlock. Hey, Declan, why don't you give me your password? I'm just gonna check out your browsing history. Hard pass. Water sites. Drilling site approved. Thermal scan shows multiple yada yada yada. I'm sure if I read everything. Yeah, I'm expecting jump scares at any moment now. That's a terrifying toilet. power cell and inventory it's a shower it is a shower that's schmancy huh all right well, I, have my I power should cell. grab that cell powering the facility before I go yep taking it with me situation at the solar site. Panels are out of alignment again. Until the Cyrano gets here, I don't have the parts to test. Can't confirm the issue 100%. All right, just so you know, anything breaks around here and I've got four Orochi execs on my ass. If you want to explain to them why a multi-million dollar piece of equipment is being manually adjusted every day, be my guest. But we have a mission and I'd rather focus on that, not fucking filling out paperwork. Wow. Copy? Copy. Not your fault. But after the Cyrano lands, no excuses. Get it done. Over and out. She, uh... She sounds like she's having a bad day. I'm the one that didn't sleep well. Sounds like it already helped with his morale. Restores power to base. You, what did you add to my 
added something. Ah, whatever. Alright, looks like I'm heading back. I already took care of what I needed to. Reminds me of someone. Ooh. need to get those solar panels up and running again. I got them up and running. They're, fo they're faced in the right direction. Really? solar panels you're talking about, sir. Those solar panels are up and running. Talking about those far ones out there? section of the scaffolding here has collapsed. Oh, it was the witch! Or we had a minor quake recently. You know, take your pick, though. Declan, the solar panels are now calibrated. Heading up the hill to the conduit. Uh-huh. Uh, I mean, copy that. Guy sounds like he's having one heck of a day. Everybody sounds so bored with their jobs. The power conduit is shut down. There should be a fuse switch on one of the sides. the lever, Kronk. Looking good. Power should be back on. Sweet. Going green. Uh, Shane, I've got good news and bad news. Good news, I think we just found water on Mars. Bad news, it is spraying all over the greenhouse. Restoring power must have triggered the pumps, and I'm showing significant pressure loss across Let's the system. Let's see if fall damage happens. cut off remotely. Oh, sorry, cowboy. This is a job that requires your hands-on expertise. Ow. All right, heading back now. He doesn't sound excited to see you. 
I have water spraying all over my greenhouse. I would not expect this from a new Can't you just turn it off? I do not have time for this. You will fix this. Jeez. Who's shitting her cereal? Ha! <laughs> all right. Well, folks, I'm sorry. I thought there would be a lot more jump scares. Things aren't good when you can see your retinas. I think... <clears throat> I think Vlad and I are the only ones actually enjoying this this version of a horror game because you know it's it's so far not all that scary. Um, honestly, I thought that it would kickstart a lot quicker than that. Uh, I mean, we've still got another hour left in the stream. We'll see what we can get to, but I was expecting more jump scares than that. But so far, I it's a good game. I'm enjoying playing it. Things aren't good when you can hey, see your retina. Still fighting that headache? That's yeah, true. I still can't shake that dream. Part of it was a memory from when I was a kid. Weird. It was the last birthday party my mom was around for. She left not long that after flooded that. flooded greenhouse. Damn. Know what happened to her? Not really. It was big news when she disappeared. She was a big shot theoretical mathematician. Oh yeah. Everyone knows Dr. Newhart. I mean, I had to read engineering dimensions in grad school. All I know is, the day after my birthday, I head downstairs for breakfast, and I couldn't find her. The basement door was wide open. It was the only place she could be, I thought. So, I went down. There was a, a like a, a... Well, she wasn't there. Or anywhere. Whoa. We searched for years. Yeah, I definitely needed that. Wow. <laughs> Feels like I'm back in therapy. Well, no better place to tackle your problems than from 130 million miles away, right? I wonder how long these things retain their oxygen levels. Look at his hands. Oh, wait. So watch his hands when he picks those up. See that? He's got those two circles on one of his hands, his right hand specifically. Hmm. Anyway. Gloves? <laughs> no gloves. And no gloves! Flooding in the greenhouse sector. Declan, the greenhouse is definitely in a sorry state. This has Ooh. got to be fixed before the Cyrano lands. Well, the major issue is the water reclaimer. No, I'm reading it as offline. Work your magic. Hmm. 
air filter plants and their growth in Martian soil. Oh, this makes me want to watch that. Uh, Larkspur, babe, this makes me want to watch the Martian again. That, that. Yeah. Flint should be more exciting. Oh, I know. It's a good movie. Yes, it is. Open. Journal notes. General botany log. I don't really feel like reading that. I'm sure this game would also be much more frightening if I actually sat and read everything. So I think I want to play this game again when I'm not streaming. But for now, we'll just keep everything moving forward. is probably in there. Yep. That's what I thought. Okay. So apparently there's a tool in here that I supposedly need. Fantastic. I'll need this. Should be able to pass through now. Let's 
See, now I'm getting to the point where I'm expecting a jump scare through every door. Looks like it needs a higher security level. Uh, Ina? What is it? The door to underground access is locked. I have instructed Dr. Van Buren to lock all doorways to critical projects. This is the culmination of my entire life's work. We do not want contamination. I can't fix it if I can't get to the pumps. That is an inconvenience? You are the inconvenience. Figure it out. That is your job, yes? Wow. What a jerk. should have sent a plumber. What a mess. I gotta keep an eye on that steam so I don't get burned. Shit! Dr. Volkova? What was that? <laughs> It's a big, strong Russian woman. Her character sounds like the new Captain America from the Falcon and Winter Soldier. It's a big, strong Russian woman. I'm glad I didn't look up. I just saw the shadow. to the experience, shall we, and just turn off the light. Yeah? Alright, here we go. <laughs> I don't want to go down here. I really don't want to go down here in the dark. Challenging myself a little bit more than I normally would because yeah let's see what happens okay so apparently I can't go through there or the other way Where I heard something else moving around out here. Uh, what is that? Uh, <laughs> yeah. Did anybody else, like, at the end of this hallway, see something moving? Nope, resisting the urge to turn off the lights. Look 
into my eyes. Anyway. Whoa! Gremlins sneaking around. Okay, I was not moving, and there was definitely something else moving around. Why? Well, I asked for scarier for sure, but this is not... No. Ina, the entire mangrove root structure is contaminated. There is a viscous black substance like a oil and it's it moving. seems like it's spreading it is not contaminated it is changing evolving it's beautiful it is reborn this doesn't look right oh, constant interruptions i do not have time to explain myself to you well i think we just found our antagonist a crazy freaking botanist he leaves his ID. At least he has a higher clearance level. Well, Lucas, I'm gonna need to borrow this for a bit. Should be able to open these doors now. Jesus, this can't be Lucas again. Who just takes this stuff apart? Now I have to find where he put three water reclaimer pieces? I think the botanists are all in cahoots. <sighs> Let's scan for him. Let's see if I can find him. the doors. Lucas, the pieces for the water reclaimer are missing. Where are they? Uh, the, the reclaimer pieces are in their proper receptacles. More specifically? Follow the colored pipes. Yeah, sorry, hang on, I'm needed elsewhere. Hmm. I found the environmental control console. Great. That's the last thing you need to clean up the greenhouse. But first, you need to restore the water reclaimer and shut off the sprinkler valves. Follow the colored pipes. Let's go with blue first. broken door I need to get through. I 
Anybody notice that that door opened one way, but I stepped through the other? So it opened like this, or at least started opening like this, but then I stepped through like that. Here I am talking about buggy game graphics to ease the fact that I'm on edge, to say the least. Okay, so that's how I came in. Ooh, what's back in door number one and two? Oh, just bathrooms. Just bathrooms. I'll turn the lights off. Let's add to the effect in here. Here, I'll leave it up to the audience. Should I keep the light on or turn the light off? On or off? On or off? That is the question. Off. Thanks, babe. <laughs> as long as you can see, off is fine. Yeah, I can see. I just, uh... I found one of the components. Oh, great. Now just find the other two so we can clean up this mess. Add to inventory. So I've got two offs. Alright, I'll leave it off for now. Man, this greenhouse is something else. Oh, ha, ha. Ah. Let's head into areas I can't see. That's fantastic. Jesus. What? What did I just miss? My vision went blurry there for a second. Oh dear. Ah, this reminds me of the movie Stephen King's The Mist. Ah. Turned those off, that's part of the objective. Everything creaking sure isn't helping. Yeah, that's not helping. Jesus. Up. What's down there? I'll be avoiding that door now. Oh, why am I okay? So it the the, the I guess the crazy thing is the. The botanists are what uh, quest. Fix the leaks, a.k.a. be a plumber. Right. Uh. Warning. Warning. Containment breach. That's not good. I, I feel like... So, Crazy Botanist did something stupid with plants. And, uh, I, I all of a sudden feel like I need Jeff Goldblum here saying, you know... Oh, oh gosh, Atherin, what's the phrase? What's what does he say? We were so worried about whether or not we could, we didn't stop to ask whether or not we should. Oh, 
This person definitely had a bad day. Whoever was sitting on the toilet here had a, a really bad day. Fix the leaks, aka okay, bingo. We were so preoccupied with whether or not we could, we just never stopped to ask whether or not we should. Gonna need a, a really big plumber. And the person... Uh, well, never mind, I won't go there. Nope. No. No. All right, well, I'll leave the lights off for now. Wow. Something is loose. Uh, something? What something? I don't know <laughs> yet. Okay, I'll contact Wilcox at the landing site. She'll get Lucas to talk. He should know what Wilcova's been doing in there. Just hang tight and get that reclaimer online. Oh, that's messed up. All right, well, ladies and gentlemen, I am out of water. I need water. So I'm going to take a brief break, and I will be right back. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, I'm back. What were they keeping in cages? Scientists. Got two out of three. Something is blocked from the other side. Great. All right, let's step through the glass. Follow the blue pipe first. Let's follow this next. Ah, oh, yeah. Holy shit, Ina. Dr. Volkova, where are you? Something is seriously wrong. The infection is everywhere. Not infection. It's evolution. Adaptation. Perfection. My children, they grow so quickly. Wrapped in creeping rootstocks. Where sap and blood coagulate. Do not fight it. Allow it to blossom. First in human history, the merging of two life forms. Yeah, okay. This one needs the nut house.
this lady? I, yeah. She sounds like Poison Ivy. That's weird. Nope. I don't want to go down there. Go up the stairs. Wait. Something tells me I've already been this way. Yeah, okay, I've already been this way. Scanner is not helpful. Jeez, they've really let these plants take over. I think this is the last one. I'll also have to turn off the sprinklers manually, or the system won't reboot. I did. Jeez. Is someone there? I did turn off the sprinklers.
See, that door did fine. Like the dark room? No. I've had enough of dark rooms as of late. Leaving the dark rooms. Wow, that actually shows me the way. Okay. I know what am I supposed to do. Thank <laughs> you. 
Huh. Scan it. Let's see where we're at. Connect. Ha! I guessed. Ha! I I ha! I completely guessed. Oh, wait. Dang. Okay. Maybe that's on here. gonna make me figure all of them out so they have to gosh darn it I wasn't wanting to do math tonight so they all have to equal 80 really wasn't wanting to do math right now. So, well, this will be easy. To so it's... Okay, so hold on. This number is split two ways. This number is split three ways. That's split three ways. So red. So 140 split three ways. Gosh darn it. I'm gonna need my computer. That equates out to is it forty seven? That equals 80. 
That has to be right. Seventy-two. Uh, which there, I wish there were notes or something somewhere that I could look at that would give me the right calibration. Let's try it at Alright, so this one has to be yellow. Let's try it at ninety. See what we got. All right, is there one that says, Ha! I figured it out. Okay. Dang it! Boom. I should have it all at eighty now. All right, up and running again. Just oh. need to switch on the environment control console. Should be right outside the door. Should be right outside the door. Which door? This door? Pardon me. Ugh. Annoying. I wasn't wanting puzzles, I was wanting jump scares. What the hell? Declan, are you there? Declan! God damn it, Declan! Oh, what the? Uh, what is that? The thing in the mist. See, I called it. I called it. This is like Stephen King's book. What the f This is your 
your reward. Yay, you fixed things, but not really, you made it worse. Whoa! Yup! Going this way. Nope! Nope, bye! Bye! What the? F no, 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 no. Okay, that's apparently not the way out. <laughs> we start from last checkpoint. Okay, apparently that was not the way to get out. <sighs> yeah. Uh, uh, no, 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 no. Apparently. That was not the way to go. There's a horrible creature in the greenhouse. It tried to kill me. Do not return to base. Does anyone read me? Ina, Lucas, Commander Wilcox. I've got to warn them. I think the scientists kind of wanted you to do that all along, but, uh, yeah. Shaking. If I can get to Declan at the satellite station, we can try to reestablish communications.
Uh, I really don't like things chasing me through scary, dark tunnels. Filled with water. A lot of horror movies have scenes where there's water, and something always pops up out of the water. That greenhouse scene was actually very well done, and ha uh -huh. Misa no liken the scary. Refill my air. What? What the fuck? Declan? There's something wrong. Where did everything go? Ha <laughs> ha. I don't want to go stare into the light for just a second. Let's see what is down here. <laughs> cave of Madness. Okay. I'd prefer the Cave of Wonders, but hey. Oh my god. Why is it glowing? What the, the orb is reacting to my hand? Shit! What's going on? It's burning under the skin. Why is this happening? Okay, I'm confused. Yeah, what the... <laughs> ah, my hand. Oh, it doesn't like that. When I turn to look at it, it retreats. You died. You start from last checkpoint, apparently. Gosh darn it. All right. <laughs> so it says if you look at it, it retreats. So I think I'm going to walk after it. No, apparently you're not supposed to do that because you die. <laughs> the orb is reacting to my hand. Shit. What's going on? Why is this happening? Oh, it doesn't like that. When I turn to look at it, it retreats. The orb is glowing.
three connections, all pointing to individual orbs. Fully powered. It's burning under the skin. You go away. This one's working differently. The scar is not charging this enough. Uh, maybe I need more energy. What the hell is this place? This is very curious. Huh. You go away. You go away. I will follow you into this little corridor. Hi there. I see you. Yeah, I see you. We shall see. See you. Yeah, back off. Yeah, yeah, back off, back off. Whoever was here was trying some kind of experiment. All right. Well, ladies and gentlemen, it's it's close enough. I think I'm gonna go ahead and start calling it here. Um. Uh, so, let me go back here so that whatever that is doesn't follow me too far down in here, and I'll just keep talking while I do. So, one thing I do want to bring to everybody's attention, this purple bar, I haven't done it this whole time, right down here, down here, it says 96 out of 100. We need that to equal 100 out of 100, so please, hit that follow button, tell your friends, tell your family, tell your dogs, 
Tell the people down the street, people you don't like. I don't care. Get them to watch our streams. But this is my final game of our Spooktober event. Uh, I don't know. If I had to rate which one I had the most fun with. De okay. And people can disagree with me as, as, as much as they want. The one that I had the most fun with, I think, was to... Ah, it's a close tie between last week's game and tonight's game. I, I actually really did enjoy playing um, White Day, a labyrinth called School. Uh, now, as far as the spookiest game to me, it was Horror Adventure. That game... Uh, um, I definitely want to continue playing this game, so this might be a game that I keep for next year. And uh, next Spooktober, who knows?